American Idol winner and became Miss Independent with her debut album. Her Grammy-winning follow-up Breakaway catapulted her into superstardom, selling 10 million copies, spawning five top 10 hits and making her the most successful female artist in American Top 40 history. After the platinum selling My December, this Texan-born songstress is back in full force with a number one single and plenty more to come from the chart-topping album All I Ever Wanted. And all we want is Kelly Clarkson! You like shot me off and I was smiling. Because you, you've done that in real life. In you've real flown life, through the air. I've been working in a circus. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> have you, have, would you like to uh, christen our pinata? I would. I heard I could. Have you okay. pinata before? Oh my God. I'm from Texas. We get drunk and do this. <laughs> <laughs> Can you I really smack it? Everyone stand back. Can I really go yeah, for it? Belt it. Okay, okay. Belt it. Oh! That was crap. That was crap. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Get him on the rebound. <laughs> <laughs> you know, oh, you got some lolly teeth. No, Pete, we'll grab the lolly oh, teeth lolly for Kelly. Teeth. Oh, 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 yours, Kelly. I get another souvenir. Just a little bit, get some more. Yeah. <laughs> I'll take the oh, money. Oh, <laughs> you, 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 awesome. you knocked his little sombrero off. Oh, those are just They're gross. They're candy teeth. Oh, you can eat them? Yeah, look at this. <laughs> oh, not now, you won't eat them now. Oh. But the, the trick is, like, as kids, you do this. <laughs> That fun. So attractive. <laughs> yeah. How are you going? I'm good. I'm good. Hey, I got to say congratulations with this album because you broke a Billboard chart record with this. From yeah. Number yeah. 97 to number one. Yeah, we did. We were very excited. <laughs> that's, that's amazing. Yeah, we were. Well, it's one of those things like I didn't know people had heard the song like enough to even like vote or buy it, and like I just have a really super loyal fan base. So, woo. <laughs> this this album to me seems to be a, a, a happier album than you've done before. I know everyone says that. I think it's just because I'm like a colorful superhero on the cover of it. Because <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's songs on there like "Cry" and there's so, I, I like a kind of an in-depth. You know, it's kind of a roller coaster ride on every album. But no, it is very much more colorful and like I guess candy-like. So do do you find it's easier to write uh, songs like happier songs or, or sad songs? I love this question because then everybody thinks I need therapy after I answer it. But I don't. I love writing the sad stuff because it gets it out of you. Man, so you are messed up. It's You're like serious. I know. I know. Wow. I know. Well, I mean, the fun stuff isn't really fun to write. It's it's you know more fun to like sit there and you know be like neener neener in the song. Ex-boyfriend or something. Neener, neener. Neener, neener. You're writing songs about I was trying sirens. to be PC and not say yes. No, but, but yeah. you've, you claim to have never been in love. Well, no, I mean, I just mean, like, you can... I mean, I've loved people. I've never been, like, the... See, I get misquoted. I've never been in love, like, I thought I was going to get married and, like, be with that person forever. I've never felt that. But you've... I love people. I love my mom. I love oh, my I'm brother. I'm not saying you don't I love, love your parents. I love, like, people I've dated, like, as in general. Like, I love people, but I've never felt, like, that kind of love. I've never heard the bells or whatever. Really? No, I know. I'm very uh, much an extremist then. I'm like either all in or I'm like me. Who so. do you hate, Kelly? Yeah. Who, do you, who do you hate? I don't really hate anyone. What about Soldier Hero? Uh, <laughs> you know what, though? I've been hearing this story ever since I've been in Australia. I've been here for a few days, and uh, that's insane. Well, because you're in Texas, and that's close to Mexico. Well, I mean, I, don't, I didn't even hear it there. I heard it here, but I just think that's insane. This, I mean, it's almost so absurd. It's just, I mean, you have to make I mean, you're, you're a, a Texan, but yes. would you still sort of feel, you know, the aftermath of George W. Bush, that you sort of hear that from Australians, and that we would pigeonhole a Texan because of that? No, no, I definitely don't ever feel that. Ever, I mean, nobody usually brings that up. Oh, good, because we all think you're... <laughs> <laughs> no, nobody ever brings it up. I mean, Lord no, I... Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> hey, I'll take a whack. <laughs> no, nobody ever does that. But no, you've got a ranch in Texas, don't you? I do. Okay. I don't have like we don't like yeehaw. Oh God, ride I'm wrong horse. with everything. No, tonight. no, no, you're not. You're not. It's people. It's the last time you look on Wikipedia. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. You're kind of right. I have a thing called Eddie's Rescue Ranch, which is a, you know I get animals, I rescue them whenever they're about to put them to sleep, like dogs or cats or stuff like that. And we also have rescue horses from being slaughtered, that kind of thing. But on I live on like 60 acres, and it's not like we're riding around like don't don't don't. don't. We're not like on horses or anything. We walk. 
and you know we and I have horses and everything, but we're not like ranchers. But I do have Eddie's Rescue Ranch, which right. everybody relates to that. So how many animals do you have? Well, <laughs> I have ten horses, um, and I have eleven dogs. Wow. I know. Well, two of those are rescue ones for the the new thing we're doing right now. But um, yeah, I have. Do you ever let the dogs dogs. ride the horses? <laughs> and you got no, a little sombrero now, so... <laughs> yes! <laughs> Baby would love this. She'd rip it to pieces. So, <laughs> who would, one who of my would, dogs. You've got a, do you have 10 dogs or 11 dogs? I have 11. Who 11. walks them all? Because you're well, always touring. I know. I live on 60 acres and my, yeah. my sister and her family and my mother and um, my brother and his family all live on the 60 acres. So yeah. they all are like... We're like land barons, so they it's all a lot take of care of it. Yeah. You don't just dump them at no, Susan no, no. Milan Dog Whisperer's house <laughs> no. or something. No, and when I'm home, I'm like completely at home. Like I turn off my phone, I go hang out with them there. It's totally cool. Okay, well, cool. Are you ready for your final five? Can oh, I... yeah. What do I do with this? I know. <laughs> Half soft candy, anyone? <laughs> all right, number five. If you didn't win Idol, what would you be doing right now? I'd still be singing. I mean, maybe not on this level, but. I don't have any other talents. So. Oh. <laughs> I don't. Oh, whacking stuff with sticks, you're pretty good at that. I can no. whack the crap out of something. Number four, you say you never lie. How do we know you're telling the truth? <laughs> um, I mean, like, nowadays, like, I've learned, like, getting older, that, I mean, honesty is the best policy, even if people don't want to hear it, so. So what if a friend said, uh, does my ass look bigger than these jeans? Hey, my friends will tell me that is not flattering, and it's not the jeans that make you look fat. <laughs> They'll be like, that's just your curve. <laughs> you <know? laughs> so, no, my friends, we're really honest with each other. Ouch. Uh, no, th it's good. It's healthy. Okay, good. Yes. I'm not going to ask you. <laughs> number three, where is the strangest place you've been nude? Strangest place I've been nude? Well, that would probably be my 21st birthday. <laughs> <laughs> I was at the lake, <laughs> and I, I had too much to drink. I should not be telling this story on TV. <laughs> yes, Continue. But there are and no pictures. Were there other people around? Was um, it a dare? No, I was by myself. <laughs> no, there were tons of people around, but every, no one remembers. Oh. Yeah. We weren't driving, you know, so it's safe, but yeah. You weren't driving? No, I mean, I, we were highly intoxicated, enough to, you know. Oh, okay. And that's... But we weren't, like, you know, driving or anything, so I'm still safe, moms. So. <laughs> I was worried more about you. We, we, we were nude, but we weren't driving. I've done that, too, though. You ever play, like, the freeze out? You know, like, you turn on the air conditioning? <laughs> no. No, you know what I'm talking about? You're in the car and you play freeze out? <laughs> That's just a dumb Texas. Where's my piano? Yeah? <laughs> so, so you drive no. naked with the air conditioning. No, on. you it's whoever can it's like whoever can laugh. It's like people that are so bored in high school have no lives. <laughs> like that's me. And like you'd you'd turn on the air conditioning, you'd be like winter, and you'd see who could last the longest without putting clothes on, and you'd drive with the windows down. <laughs> oh my God. Wow. In Texas. <laughs> Number two, what is all you ever wanted? Um, I, I don't know. I mean, I, uh, to be successful, I guess, in every aspect. That's really torquey answer. But oh, you've you've done well with the nude I question. I just went You're from good that to go. Yeah, I can. Uh, and finally, your visual question. What's the first thing you think of when you see this? <laughs> um, I think his owners are high. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Thank you very much, Kelly Clarkson. <laughs> Performing for us later in the show. Thank you very much for coming in. I'm sorry. Oh, that was great. You bashed up. We'll be right back. <laughs>